Bala Vignesh. I saw you doing Chilam Bottom so beautifully, as all of you also have seen. So, how old are you? I'm 14 years old. I see. So, you said you are going to a special sports school in Coimbatore, right? Okay, where is that? Talk something about that school. Sports I am studying in Sports Hostel. Mm -hmm. uh, this year only the Sports Hostel has been opened. Uh -huh. And I am in the game gymnastics. The Sports Hostel is the Sports Hostel is in Nehru Stadium. Yes, in Coimbatore. Okay. In Coimbatore. So it is called the Sports Hostel? Yes. Why it is called the Sports Hostel? Because the students in the sports are in the here for the practice and are staying here. Staying oh, here. It's all of them are staying there, right? Yes. Oh, I see. So your food, everything will be given. Mm. So it is by the government of Tamil Nadu? Yes, oh, it's what is her mother? My mother is teacher in Isha school. Ah, she, she's a teacher, okay. okay. And uh, this is her brother, right? Yes, it's my brother. What's her name? My name is Sindhu Rodan. Oh, I see. You are also learning Chilam Bottom? Yes. I'm okay. Uh, why don't you also do it? Yes, I do. Can you do it now? Yes. Yeah. How many teachers do you have? Uh, we have four coaches and mm -hmm. one warden mm -hmm. and two people to do our efforts. So, uh, wow, you are really good in Chilam Bottom. That you don't have to learn there, right? That's not a part of their classes. Uh, I am also in Chilam Bottom, but uh, I am interested well in Gymnastics. Okay. So, yeah. uh, but my question is, in the school, you don't have to practice Chilam Bottom? No. That you practice otherwise at home? Mm. How, uh, how you were selected in that school? Anybody, everybody cannot do in that school, okay? What was the selection? Before one year, I, I joined on the gymnastic class. Mm. Because of the Silamam, on the Silamam we do floor exercise. Mm. <coughs> And doing that, um, um, gymnastic master has been came there mm -hmm. and he had said to train there. Mm -hmm. So then I joined that. After some days, uh, there has been, uh, they said that there is a hostel and hostel selection is going to be there. On the hostel selection, I performed well. Mm -hmm. and there had been near 20 to 35 students, uh -huh. but only 8 members has been. Oh, I see. So in that selection process, you, you showed your Chilam Bottom? No, hmm? gymnastics. Oh, I see. You were already... Oh, I see. You had already learned, uh, trained a little gymnastics in the same place. So, okay. okay. They did not ask you to show your Chilam Bottom? No. Not at all? Uh -huh. But uh, our gymnastic coach is uh, an international player in Chilam. Chilam Bottom? Uh, mm -hmm. He's an international coach for Chilam. He had gone to Russia. Uh -huh. So that... Uh, uh, for any competition has been come, he will train me and uh, I will also go in Salman also. Okay. Uh, but my question is, in this sports school, they did not ask you to show your Chalam Bhattam at all? No. Nobody knows that you do Chalam uh, No. They know, but they never asked you to show it? No. Oh, that is very interesting. Mm -hmm. 
So, um, uh, you said about five different sports are being trained in the school. Hmm? But you know an extra of Chirambatam. Hmm? Similarly, the other five students, other students, they also know something more. There are somebody is no, they can, uh, there are so many people who know everything. But on the level we have to achieve anything, we should only concentrate on a one game. So that we can achieve in that only more. For achieving only everyone uh, focus on the only. Mm -hmm. Everyone knows that cricket and uh, the uh, cricket and volleyball for the term. But they will give, uh, play as the, like a fun game, but not as uh, achieving. Oh, I see. Uh, not as a focus, focus uh, learning. I see. Oh, very interesting. You talk very beautifully, uh, Balavignesh. How do you do this? <laughs> Your classes are in English? No. In Tamil? In Tamil also and English. Both. English also? Mm. Oh, I see. Uh -huh. In the hostel, all the other students talk only Tamil. Mm. And nobody talks English. No. Mm -hmm. But you are talking very good English. You are talking a very difficult ideas, no? like achievement, focus, and all that. Very good. Uh, some once in a while, read some good English books also as you grow up. Hmm? Tamil is of course good, which you know. But when you go like your Chilambatam master to various other countries, you can talk English also. That is good. Tamil anyway, you know, and uh, uh, that is very good. Okay. Uh, what is your father? My father is working in a jewelry. In a jewelry. What's his name? Ravi Kumar. And your mother's name? Sumati. Ah, she is a teacher. Where? In Nisha Vidya School. Nisha Vidya School. What is her subject? Maths. Mm -hmm. And in this uh, sports school, you have to learn other subjects also? Yes. Like uh, English, uh, mm -hmm. history. Oh, that's also there. Oh, ho. How that is a separate school. After uh, 8 o'clock, we have to go to school. 8 o'clock what? 8 o'clock morning? Mm. Oh, oh, I see. All the practices are before 8 o'clock. Mm. It, it starts at what time? Start at 6 o'clock. So you have to get up at about 5 o'clock. 5 o'clock and the early morning, 6 o'clock to 8 o'clock, every day you have to practice the sports and then you have to go to the school. school. And then Which school? Suburban. Oh, that can be any school. Only two schools are allowed for the sports hostel, Manis and Suburban High School. Oh, I see. You have to be studying in that school also. Mm. Oh, okay. And there you have to learn all the subjects in class name. Mm. Like any other student. Yes. Oh, it's that a means. Uh -huh. uh, I see. Uh, uh, this, uh, this school is a government school. Yes. You are studying there. He, mm. he oh, I see. Your brother is studying there. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. So that means you are doing a great lot of extra work. So the practice is only in the daytime, in the morning? No, in the daytime and after you also... Well, see, after you come back from the school, again you have to go for practice. Uh, for what time? How much time? On 5 o'clock to uh, 7, 7 30. Every day? Daytime. So, you see, very difficult. Then after that you have to study, do the homework and all uh, for class On 8 o'clock dinner, mm -hmm. after dinner we have to study till 10 o'clock. Oh, that is very beautiful. See, this itself shows, in the, uh, sorry, Balavignesh, uh, this itself is a lesson for all the students in the world. You see, many students, they cannot even learn that school subjects. Hmm? And you, every day, morning and evening, take, as you said, very focused to practice in various gymnastic items. Hmm? And then you have to sit down and study. Oh, really wonderful. You will all become very great. So the government of Tamil Nadu or the government of India must be appreciated for such schools, right? Very great. And your teachers also must be very great, right? Very wonderful teachers. Our coaches also very. Uh, so you call this sports hostel teachers coaches, huh? Yes. Thank you, Balavignesh. Uh, how old are you, you said? Fourteen. Yeah, the way you answered uh, to these questions, very confidently and uh, very firmly. That itself shows the value and the, the beauty of the training that you are receiving with your masters. And also it shows uh, 
the quality of your father and mother. Okay? Wish you all the best. Thank you. And I'm sure, or anybody will be sure that uh, Bala Vignesh will become really well known and uh, great. Okay? Good luck. Thank you. Mm.